So this is just a short video on how to program a gateway. Um, you'll start by just pulling the tab, opening the door. Um, you'll want to write down the number right here below this, the barcode. It'll be a six digit number. Um, so that's the number we need to know in order to get it in water scope. The battery sits right in here. There's double sided tape here. You'll want to peel that back so that you can stick the battery down. The batteries plug in just like that. And then you'll want to hit enter. And we want to boot the gateway so you'll hit enter again and again. And right now it's going to try to find the time. And this could take up to a few minutes. Now it's going to try to find the location. This could take up to a couple more minutes. That doesn't really mean anything. That's more for the engineering. Location found. Now when it goes to debug, you'll want to press select all the way through the menu until it comes up to listen now. And then you'll want to hit enter. And right now it is searching for meters. We're here at our shop. So there's tons of meters for it to read. The max amount of meters that it can read is 500. I'm sure we'll reach that here. Okay, the gateway has maxed down at 500. It'll come back to debug mode. And here you wanna hit select again through the menu until you come up to send EP data. And then you would wanna hit enter. Right now, it's trying to find the cell service. It found service. It is now sending packets. It will send up to, uh, I think right now it's gonna send 50 packets. So this could take some time. Once it is done, it'll say transmission complete. Once it gets to the packet sending part of it, you're good to go. It'll go back to debug mode, and you're good to just shut the door and latch the door. We also have band clamps that will run directly through here and around your tree or your pole, and you'll tighten with a 5 16 nut drive, or you put it on your drill, you can use a flathead screwdriver, whatever you prefer. But that's how to hang a gateway.